how to work with multiple modules uh, imagine we are working on a project based upon a traditional three layered architecture in which the layers are named presentation business and integration of course you want each layer to be independent of all other layers and so you want to produce one artifact for each one following the maven norm you will need to have one project for each layer hence you are set up should look like this for example we have a three layers three projects so nowadays because of uh, uh, our project extension because of uh, java classes we are dividing into um, multiple projects for example i have a presentation project and business project and integration project so dividing three projects for one application so obviously each uh, uh, to use one project we have to build one project that project will be used by the second project business and that business after build that business project that will be used by the integration so whenever we go for the build we have to do individually and after finishing one we have to follow the uh, second and third so using uh, using uh, instead of uh, doing individually uh, we have a option in maven like working with multiple modules so using parent form we have a option to include all the uh, builds uh, all the projects into one form and we can able to do one uh, we can able to do at a time all the projects and all the projects also if we are going for the multiple modules it will follow same java version will not have any conflict with that so to compile your presentation project see if, uh, if we don't have a multiple modules for example uh, if we have any problems for example in presentation layer think we are not using multiple modules i have done build on presentation project so something got failed and uh, some files i missed out so i want to check in again so you will do again so obviously that version will be extended for the uh, second time so that problems maybe will not occur in business and integration unnecessarily to match with that version we have to follow second and third also two times so these kind of problems will not occur uh, in multiple modules it will follow uh, same version in all the applications together and uh, a multiple modules project is a very particular type of project it does not produce any artifact and is composed of several other projects known as modules when you run a command on the project it will execute it on, uh, of its uh, children of projects even better maven is able through its react component see this is our structure basically if we are not following multiple projects this is the structure and if we if we follow this is the uh, picture if you see this picture our uh, parent module will be the top position and we have a sub modules which we have to uh, do the build uh, along with parent project so this is a structure so whenever you do build on parent form that will be applicable to the uh, modules also basically uh, when, uh, for this one um, uh, before going to know about um, uh, multiple models here we have a very critical topic we have to know in in maven that is scm tags so before going to uh, see what in the setup is required for this parent pump we'll see that uh, scm tags how it will be useful in maven we'll see so that now we'll able to understand easily working with multiple modules in maven so SEM tags basically for Maven. So SEM uh, whenever we, we are going to do Maven release or Maven uh, uh, clean install, 
basically this SCM tax are very important this will be like uh, how Marvin built uh, for example in Jenkins I did set up for uh, my project so how Jenkins will react how code will be taken uh, based on what so if you understand SCM tax that will be the source for Jenkins so Jenkins build will uh, check for the SEM uh, tags inside bomb.xml based on the connection it will try to download the code from for example I am using SVN so I have to specify the SVN URL links for the code where code is available in SVN so that I have to specify in connection as well as developer connection and as well as URL so these three are very important so um, I want to tell you one more thing and uh, while using these three tags inside SEM we have to follow SEM SVN for connection and developer connection we should not follow for URL so these three are very important connection and developer connection the these two connections elements convey to how one is to connect to the version control system through Marvin where connection requires read access for Marvin to be able to find the source code yes this SEM will be useful uh, to connect where source code is available in Perforce or SVN or CBS so these are the details where exactly that code is available where connection requires read access for Marvin to be able to find the source code yeah we sh uh, Marvin should have access on source code also because this should download the code for uh, Jenkins or our local system the Marvin project has spanned another project named as a Marvin SEM which creates a common API for any SEMs that wish to implement it so these are the details we have to follow and this here you can see what URL and the tag so URL will publicly uh, repository for example via so these are like we are giving publicly uh, browsable repository so these are the details we can go and uh, download the code for that so these are the details uh, specified here this is the SEM tags I have given again and uh, Marvin release for child project so we have to specify the parent tag and this is the SEM tags details so I specified yellow background so connection and developer connection we have this so we have covered SEM tags we understand these uh, tags uh, so basically Marvin will go to the SEM tags and it will download the code for us uh, so we have seen how how multiple modules uh, in uh, Marvin will be useful so to specify that in parent bomb generally in parent bomb we know packaging bomb should be required um, if if we are going for the multiple modules nothing but presentation business integration three projects uh, uh, I am planning to uh, to build along with palm so I have to specify the module uh, details what and all module details along with that I have to specify that uh, uh, all three uh, dependents uh, all three um, projects in dependency using project dot version so whenever we do uh, parent bomb that version will be given to the module projects and it will be built automatically whenever we do multi modules whenever we do build on uh, parent so don't forget to include these three projects inside dependency and version as a parent dot version project dot version or something like that and this is the structure we have to follow for the modules uh, when I tried this multiple modules I faced a lot many problems using uh, uh, for this uh, structure so be careful we have to use this structure so it should be parallel so parent will be inside core and my modules will be inside components so structure should be very clear in branch have a component and core core will have a parent and components will have all three projects this is the structure we have to follow for repository I mean like uh, uh, central uh, I mean SVN or CVS control systems 
and we know already parent bond so obviously packaging will be bond and uh, SEM tax don't forget SEM tax for parent bond will not be direct path of not core generally if we are doing separately uh, build on parent bond we have to specify till parent but here we are doing uh, multiple module concept so we have to specify only till 201 branch alone so that it will be all the components and uh, parent will be identified by this SEM this is also one more we have to keep in mind and the modules will be like just now only I uh, gave a structure for modules so modules we have to specify because we are giving only 201 branch so I uh, we have to specify the modules like this so where exactly we have a modules location and uh, required plugins for example uh, if we want to perform uh, any maven release or something like that we have to specify the all the jars so this is maven release uh, plugin and this is uh, SEM related so for sure this is required minimum required for that and this is for coverture maven plugin and here if you see required changes for modules uh, so as of now whatever we have seen is for parent POM this is for module POM so as of now how many uh, modules POM we have presentation uh, business and integration so for a presentation uh, here we have a version tag and uh, this is the jar module jar uh, packaging as a jar and parent we have to specify and this is the parent bond details and the SEM tax will be as it is if there is no change we have to keep till presentation only in parent that uh, SEM tax will be changed uh, SEM tax will be we have to give only 201 branch not the core parent and uh, as well as we have to follow for remaining projects also so main is version change and parent uh, change and the ACM so these are one time changes so we have to do for integration also these are the steps we have to follow for multiple modules so this is the uh, changes for that and if you go to the Jenkins this is the change of changes for Jenkins so repository URL we have provided for co because we are planning to do uh, multiple modules and parent so we have to give a parent location in repository URL and uh, uh, if you want to specify anything names or something we can specify and here you have to uh, 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 remember one thing is here um, in parent pump we have specified only till branch to not one branch so uh, to identify parent for example uh, um, we have a many folders we don't know exactly where we defined that so repository url we mentioned as a core and after core we have a parent pump inside parent slash pom so that will that we have to specify here so this is a total concept once this is done you can easily do maven multi modules uh, i have seen many sites where exactly i faced many problems after facing many problems i found these solutions i kept it in uh, one uh, uh, site you can easily follow these steps if you face any problems in this directly you can come to forums and if you go to the maven you can post the questions what problem exactly you are following i understand we face many problems for uh, sure if you face that just uh, uh, post the uh, question what exactly you are facing i will reply to that thank you